this is Tasha. Um, I'm going to show y'all my couch now, how it's all set up. Um, also, I bought some stuff from Home Goods. Bought some stuff from Target. I'm going to show you the couch, how it's all set up. And, yeah, let me... Y'all have to adjust to this yellow light. I'm sorry. Okay, so... This is what it looks like. I put some Christmas decorations up. I put the tree up. I put the garland around the, the windows. And I also got a new TV. I took it out of the box. <laughs> and I put my new rug on the floor. So I'm going to flip the camera around. I'm going to show y'all what everything looks like. It's not tidy like I want it to be. But it's coming together. So. This is the rug. Disregard this. I have to go through this pile of crap. Remember, y'all, I'm in the process of getting rid of stuff. So this is... um. The Ikea table, I took it out the box, finally, and put it together. Um, this is a rug. This rug came from, this rug came from uh, Overstock. Okay, so, before I get into, I'm going to talk about the rugs. This is the rug that I originally wanted. I also picked out another rug that was in the, in the dining room. I return that rug y'all because even though it was a nice rug you got to be careful with these these types of companies like overstock and wayfair they will send you some stuff that's dirty i'm sorry they will send you some stuff that was used by somebody else they will just rewrap it and send it to you so that rug that was in the dining room i returned it the rug that was in the hallway i returned it because even that one was dirty too um the one that was in the dining room, they gave me all my money back. But um, the one that was for the hallway, um, at that moment, I didn't know that if your rug is damaged, that you can get all your money back plus shipping. That's another thing. Be careful. If it's something that you don't like and you know something's wrong with that rug, you tell them that there's something wrong with that rug and they will give you all your money back and you won't have to pay return shipping. See, I didn't know that. So, um, so yeah. That rug was not what it was supposed to be. Because sometimes they'll take pictures of things and the pictures don't even look like a doggone rug. So I returned that. And besides the fact that it was kind of dirty in certain spots, but I was willing to overlook the dirt if the rug looked like it was supposed to look on the website. You get what I'm saying? So anyway, this is the couch from Ikea. This is it. Um, this is, I put the name of the, the couch because I can't think of the name of it at this moment. But this is, this is the couch that I got from Ikea. It is technically a giant futon, y'all. That's exactly what it is. It's a little bit more comfortable. It does let out into like a full, I won't say queen, queen size, um, bed. It lets out, it folds out and folds down. Um, I did end up get purchasing some stuff to go on top so that when my mom comes, she won't be totally uncomfortable. Okay, so as you can see, these pillows still have the tags on them. These pillows came from, um, I haven't had the chance to take the tags off of them, but they came from Home Goods. Really cute. I wanted something that was a Christmassy, cool tone, Christmassy colors that I can just throw some red pillows on top. This pillow right here also came from um, Home Goods. Really cute. I like the, the little specks that's in it because it matches the couch. So I got two of those. And then these pillows, these red ones, I already had them. And then this pillow right here is from Target. So if you want some, this is the thing. These pillows right here from Home Goods, they expen they're, to me, they're expensive, but they're better quality. If you're looking for some nice pillows, go to Target. <laughs> this pillow I think was um fifteen dollars. This was fifteen. It's a little bit better quality Christmas pillow. Um, I'm gonna show you. Let's see. So the rug, pillows. This is the garland decoration. I put garland above the mantle up here. Well, not mantle. The above the the ceiling, and I also put it in the sunroom. 
because this is my office, y'all. So I, I actually work in here. And um, so yeah, garland. And also got some picture frames. Now, as you can see, this picture frame, I just, this is sometimes what I do. When I get picture frames in, I just put them up. I've already ordered pictures to go in there, but I want things to be in place now before the pictures come. I think they're due to come because I ordered some pictures from China. I'll show you guys what those look like when they come. Um, so, yeah, I just want the pictures frames up on the wall. And all of that stuff has to go back into storage. This is going to be my next project, y'all. These cabinets are from Ikea. Now, the doors, these doors I am replacing. These, these, this is what I use to store all my craft stuff in. Um, right now, I put wheels on them so that, because they're heavy as hell. And I use it to push them. I can push these around the, the house if I really wanted to. But the doors are coming from Ikea. These doors I'm being, I'm going to replace them with some more doors. This this model of cabinet, I have to place it. I'll put it in the um, on the screen what type of cabinets these are. This is an older version of a, of a brand of cabinet they already have. But the doors that I'm picking out are going to fit right on here. So what I'm going to do with these, I'm going to repaint. I'm going to sand them, repaint them, put new doors on it. It's going to look brand new when I'm done. So, so yeah, this is my next project. Um, but of course I gotta wait for Ikea. I gotta wait for Ikea to get stuff in stock, y'all. They don't never have stuff in stock. Never. Um This is the new rug. Disregard this. This is um I got some wreaths that I need to put back in storage. Um this is the new rug that I picked out. This is from Overstock. Um I'm kind of scared to take it out the package. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to y'all. I'm scared to take it out the package because I'm hoping it looks... No, no, no. That rug, because I got scared to over order from Overstock, that's from Wayfair. So, if I'm going to take that out. It'll probably be the last thing that I do today is take that rug out of the packaging just to see what it looks like. And I'm hoping to God that it's good because if it's not, I'm going to be mad. So now I'm going to show you guys the rug that I, I, I just told you that I ordered, a, I ordered a rug from Overstock and I returned it. This is the rug that I put, that I got in place of that rug. This rug I got from Home Goods Because you can see what it looks like at Home Goods. Can't see what it looks like from Overstock. This is the rug I got from Home Goods. It's pretty. It's a blue, gray um, it hides dirt because my son is disgusting. So, yeah, I am happy with this rug. It's a beautiful color. Um, so, yeah. What have I bought that I have not shared? What have I bought? Oh, I got some pictures. I also got some picture frames from Ikea. And I got a new entryway table. I haven't even taken... I ain't taken none of this stuff out the box, y'all. I'm so bad. Um... I got these picture frames from Ikea. These are the river frames. They're in black. I also have them right over there in white. And I have them over here in black. So like I told you, I'm going to prop these up on the wall because I don't want them right now. As you can see, I got picture frames just sitting on the floor. I can't have picture frames sitting on the So this is my new council table. I'm hoping it looks nice, though. Um, I'm going to take this out the box today and unbox it. I also have another unit from Ikea that's going in the bathroom because I needed a small cabinet, y'all. A small, small cabinet. I got this cabinet from Ikea. It's called Bo Baguero. Okay, so this is what it's called. Um... I needed a small picture frame. To, I know I needed a small cabinet for the bathroom because my bathroom is so freaking. It is so tiny. It's so tiny. It's not tiny. It's long, and I don't have that much storage in this place. There's no storage in here, y'all. Um. So I have to get cabinets to 
to make up for the storage space that I need. So I found this one because every place else for small cabinets or the tall ones that go straight up, they want $100. It's a freaking cabinet. Why is it $100? <laughs> Let me stop being so cheap. But still, I don't want to spend $100 for a cabinet. I just don't. That cabinet right now is on sale at Ikea for 20 It was It was originally 50 and they knocked the price down to 24 Maybe because it's not, it might not be selling. I don't know. But, um... Maybe that's why I threw it, they threw it on sale. But, um, but yeah, I got it for like $24.99. So, I snatched that up real fast because I needed a cabinet for the bathroom. So, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to unbox the cabinet for the bathroom. And then, um, and then I'm going to unbox the council table because I need to take that. I need to get that stuff out of the hallway. And I need to get this hallway together. So I'm gonna unbox it in this video, but I'm gonna get it every I'm gonna put everything together in the next vlog. Okay. So so yeah, so let me do that. Mm -hmm.